Make sure you like this video, comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe. What's going on YouTube? Snipes here with TKO Gaming, bringing you guys the first part of the quest line, the brand new quest line of the Necrochasm. So as you guys know, you guys can kill ogres or knights in the nightfall, and as you do so, you will get a random white little orb drop, and that will be your husk of the pit. You need to have a year three husk of the pit, guys. Then on your husk of the pit, you're going to have to either kill knights or witches. All you have to do is inspect the weapon, and you'll find out. And over here, I'm in siege of Warmind to kill two knights and I jump off the map so you guys can do that as well get to that part and if you do get the witches then you have to go to the chamber a night strike or whatever this is story mission and what you do is you can kill this witch and you can then kill yourself or at the end there's three witches definitely recommend the three witches at the end of this strike playlist whatever the hell it is sorry guys we don't pve that much as you know but we're gonna give you guys the best guides that we can possibly give. Now, coming in after you're done with that, and pretty much you have to kill it just to rank it up, you're gonna get your Edolon's ally. And what you have to do is you have to come over here and speak to the speaker and what he's going to give you is 24 motes of light pretty much he wants you to level it up once you get leveled up all the way to the end then you can continue doing what you need to do with that gun but what you need to do after that is you need to go over to eris morn the little girl that just cries in the corner all the time yeah go to her real quick and she's gonna give you the next step as well and what you're gonna be getting is the crux of darkness quest line now this quest line is pretty much what we think the end of the necrochasm quest line but we're going to be bringing part two to you guys as well and we're going to be showing you guys really fast what the idolon ally looks like and depending on whether you get knights or witches on your husk of the pit that will determine whether you get glass half full or rangefinder on your idolon ally so that is something to also keep in account because they switched up just one thing so it's pretty cool i got knights so i got glass half full if you're going to get witches then you're going to get rangefinder uh, it really doesn't matter because you know we want the year three necrochasm that's what we want so after this the last step of the quest line is pretty much killing omnigal and then killing crota and then probably getting that little exotic thing to then upgrade your idolon ally into a necrochasm and we're going to be bringing you guys those steps as well so make sure you guys subscribe if you haven't if you want help in raids or trials of osiris we guarantee everything for you guys all you have to do is follow us on twitter and turn on notifications it's at real tko gaming as well as follow us on twitch twitch.tv slash real tko gaming and everything you need to know is in the description below thank you guys so much for watching this video make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications because we are going to be making so many destiny videos for you guys the best of the best to help you guys complete this game and then keep growing with the family and just do the best that we can guys have fun all right guys we'll love you so much we'll see you in the next one guys peace